Hi, I'm Tai. Hi, Tai. Um, I think I re I knew I've always had a, a, a hearing loss problem, but something that I never really took seriously. And I'm happy that I've got these gadgets now to help me along with and look forward to hearing everything. Yeah. <laughs> My name is uh, Lola Tomato Toshi Maria Toa. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you too, mm -hmm. Doc. I decided to come because I want to hear things. Mm -hmm. And I think when you can't hear, it's not very good. Yeah. You miss a lot. <laughs> you miss out. My name is Yitsishwane Salema, all friends and colleagues from New Zealand, and I'm very proud and, and grateful for what they've done. Yeah, it's good to hear hopefully with my proper hearing. Hello, my name is Tai Tai. I'm from Papua New Guinea, and uh, I'm grateful. I had hearing problem for a while, which I don't really remember when, but I remember when every time my kids talk to me, I'd say, what? Olea? Olea in Samoan means what? Yeah. And I thank you guys because it's really a service to us. And I, I looked at the, the gang outside and I thought, isn't that a big need for our people? Mm -hmm. I, I'm grateful for what, what has happened to me. Now I can hear people speaking and I can hear it clearly. And that was nice. It was a privilege to be here and to be able to help the people out here. The whole experience for me was very fulfilling and um, humbling I would say. There was this one client um, I saw yesterday, she put her hearing aids on for the first time and broke into tears. It was absolutely heartbreaking and she told me that she hadn't heard anything she, since she was 10 years old. It was so emotional, so rewarding and this is why I've come. It was absolutely mind-blowing and a very emotional trip. Um, just being able to help so many people has been just amazing and um, I'm so glad that I had the opportunity to come. Being able to give them new hearing aids and help them be part of their community and communicate with their family better was really amazing and such a rewarding experience. I have been really thankful for, uh, while we've been here in Samoa, who've been the ladies at CNC. It's been amazing seeing how they've um, picked up the different things that we've been doing, how they've developed their testing and their skills with connecting and um, sort of fitting the hearing aids. And so it's really exciting to think that they'll be able to support the people we fitted um, while we're not here. We fitted 215 people, which was amazing. And to see the looks on their faces and their family members' faces and knowing that the, you know, we've made such a difference to their lives, I will be forever grateful and humbled. The people are just, we're just amazing. Um, so grateful um, and just so happy with the service that we've provided. 